A state lawmaker's recent drug driving conviction is raising the big question, what does this mean for her re-election campaign? Republican Representative Monica Youngblood was sentenced yesterday to one day in jail after being convicted of aggravated DWI. Next month, voters on Albuquerque's west side will decide whether to re-elect Youngblood or opt for Democrat Karen Bash. As to whether the conviction will hurt Youngblood's long-term political career, UNM political expert Gabe Sanchez says he expects she'll bounce back. But as far as this election goes, he says the ball is in her opponent's court. It's really up to her opponent, Ms. Bash, to really capitalize on the opportunity and put out some mailers or some other you know, campaign materials to highlight this issue in order for it to really be effective. Now, Sanchez also pointed out that while some are calling for Youngblood to drop out of the race, she's still her party's only chance to keep the seat since it's too late to replace her with a new candidate.